What is going on guys? Today we are back and today, um, all right, cool. We'll share. Um, I was in a car crash last night and, um, and I tweeted a little video after it happened and just this morning posted on Instagram a picture of my car. Thanks for all of the uh, concerns and the love you guys have sent, but I'm fine. My friend that was in the car is fine and I have almost all the footage from that day. I filmed a bit on my phone, but I don't have the dash cam footage available for you guys yet just because of insurance and my attorney said so, but I'm going to do everything I can to release it soon so you guys can watch. It. Prove that I wasn't driving like a complete idiot. Obviously in the footage I'm about to show you guys I didn't like explain what happened because I was just in shock. My freaking car just got rammed into a fence. A steel pipe fence. So real quick I'll give you the backstory on what actually happened. It was another typical day around here. My friend Sam from middle school hadn't hung out with him in a long time and he came over and of course he hadn't been in my car. So I was like you want to go on a ride? There's not much else to do. And we just went down a road that I've been down a million times. Once I can show you the dash cam footage I'll show you more dash cam footage of me driving down the same road. We drove up to this road that I always go on and we actually passed the cop that would soon be questioning me as my car is mangled on a fence. I stepped on the gas a little bit just to show him the power of the car, like why else would I take him on a ride? I'm not a grandpa that owns a Lamborghini and never goes quick, but we didn't like reach some insane speed. So we took a slight right like curve and then we just kept going down the road. There was a left curve coming up, but whenever I turned right, I was now going west. The sun was setting and it was so unbelievably bright. Here's a screenshot from the dash cam. Sam couldn't see, I couldn't see see my sun visors are literally like four inches. They do nothing, especially when you're five foot, seven and a half, five foot eight. And watching back the footage, it just looks so avoidable. It looks so stupid. It looks like I just drove off the road, but I couldn't see the freaking road. As soon as my tire went into the grass and there was that little downhill, it kind of just like sucked me off the road. And we just went barreling towards a fence and I could not slow down whatsoever. I slammed on my brakes. I didn't pull my e-brake because I've never done that on grass going that fast. I, I didn't know what it was going to do. I didn't try to like turn the wheel or anything because I didn't want us to flip. I think that would have made it worse. I was pushing on the brake and it was just like popping back up. It would not slow me down whatsoever on that wet grass, soil, whatever it is. And you could see somewhere along the lines, the back of my car snapped, like right there. Like I, I don't even know how that happened. Whenever we collided with that fence, first off, you can literally see sparks of when I collided with it. The pipe just snaps, there's sparks everywhere. And we'd go past the fence, but the cables on the fence literally grabbed us, pulled us back. So we literally drove under it and then went back. It was weird. And as you'll see, that is how the top of my car got so damaged. It just got like ripped up and after it registered that oh, we just we crashed I look over at Sam make sure he's okay He did the same to me what a good pal and then smoke just comes barreling in. we're like oh crap thought it was on fire So immediately turned off my car tried to get out he got out a lot faster than me I don't know if my door was like messed up my door was giving me issues Then we got out got away from the car I had to go back into the car to get my phone because I kind of forgot it But yeah, then we sat out in the cold for a few hours waited for the cops. You'll see so uh, yeah Here is the iPhone footage from that day my phone, oh my god. Are you kidding me, bro? Oh my god. First of all, I'm sorry to you. Oh my god, we uh we took out we took out the fence, yes we did. Yeah. Yep. We'll let him know. Hey is all up in here. Dude, look at that path. No way. We literally flew off the road. Thank god this car does not like to flip, because look at how steep that is. And we just Parts of my car all over the place. The wrap everywhere. No way. I'm like, I'm too like in shock and like scared for you no, I'm good. To, like, to be mad right now. The sun is setting right there. And as you can see around that corner, it was so bright I couldn't see anything. I was going decently fast, but I've done this a million times. This road is the one I go down all the time. I downshifted, couldn't see, and just went off the road, slammed on the brakes, Continued to just go through here not slowing down whatsoever. We hit this at about 40 40 mile an hour. We hit this fence. We kind of took out that pillar, but I mean that's what probably smashed the back dude My tire is sideways There is no way all of that is just ripped up mirrors off um, Huge scratch over my rose right here None of the windows are shattered are they? No, nope. you're good with windows. Yeah, I windows think. down um, yeah, this is all. That's so bad, bro. Tech, this is oh my gosh. This got ripped off. Bro, bro I don't want to have to tell my mom that this happened because she's going to be so scared. Uh, if I can talk to her, I can. I've owned this car for over a year, year and a half. That's driven so it a million times, driven it down this road a million times. So, um, we're going to go over here. This thing is just piled up, still smoking. It smells it's, so yeah, bad. This is really hot. 
Oh, oh my god, my mirror up there got ripped off somehow. How does that even happen? But yeah, from the sun, like my sun visors are so small as you guys can see whenever you're sitting in here. They do nothing. This is just like when I flew off the road in California. It didn't register. Like it's going to register, but I'm, I'm so, as the kids would say, shook right now. Why is there blood on my phone? I don't know. There's literally no blood. Oh, it's my finger. Yeah. My thumb's bleeding. These are the, this is the only injury I have sustained. Um, I guess we call my mom. That's a nice piece. If you guys don't know who he is, he's my friend <laughs> Sam from middle school. You know, was, we were just hanging out playing some Fortnite. He's going to take him on a ride and this happened. <laughs> wow. My whole bumper. <laughs> Look at what those wires did on the fence. Completely just ripped up all the sides. This is not real. Look at this. Okay. Yep. All right. You got a bird nest. Yep. Bird nest in here. That's bikes. These dudes are on bikes and they're about to fly by us. And here they come. <laughs> yeah. We got a group of bikers. Uh, what's up, guys? <laughs> Rip. It's a it's a bad day. It's a bad bad day. You guys are just out having fun too on this road. I'm guessing. Yeah. yeah. It's uh, it's not a good day. We uh went off the went around the curb. The sun was in my eyes. Sheriff's got to see it before we can uh, get towed out of here because I hit someone's fence. The exhaust is just mangled, chilling. I'm surprised that no airbags. My, go off, honestly. I know. How did the airbags not go off? I've never had airbags go off. Well, my truck's gone, my R8's gone, I got a Challenger still. I better start treating that thing right. So it starts all the way over there, comes and comes and comes, all the way to there is where we hit. And if I was going any faster, I would have flown off that hill. I wouldn't have, there wouldn't be tire marks all the way up there. And then I just could not slow down down here. Imagine if we were going 80, 100, we would have flown off here and just flipped. Not okay. All right, we're gonna call the cops and call my mom. Goodbye, guys. <laughs> well, the mystery of it all is, where is my mirror at? I mean, we've looked all over. <laughs> There's nowhere to be found. Some of my glass did <laughs> shatter, no. That's, that's a keeper for sure. <laughs> Our boys are back. We're still chilling here. <laughs> so I kind of just realized like there's this big hole and how would that happen? Just realized that's a gigantic concrete like slab that goes under the ground to hold the fence in place. And we uprooted it. Oh, we took out an entire post. Yeah. I didn't <laughs> notice. <right> here. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Sheriff, where you at? It's getting cold. Night falls upon us. <laughs> Sheriff has arrived. Uh, what a pretty sunset. Oh, yeah. Well, we are... Uh... Come on, get in there, buddy. I'd say we've been here about an hour now. Um... Well, the sun has setted. Here's a pretty picture from this. My mom, brother, sister have arrived after a little bit of yelling and a lot of hugs. Uh, we're about to get it towed. And now to FaceTime Quentin McConaughey. What? Huh. So I got a surprise for you. It's grass. The grass is not the surprise. Did you crash the uh, Challenger? Oh my god. Uh, yeah, you want to see something crazier besides that we hit the fence? Can, can, can you get a full frame of that again so I can screenshot it? <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, it was smoking whenever we stopped. Um, the rose is completely well, scraped. No shit, it was smoking when you stopped. <laughs> <laughs> like, the engine was almost on fire and the gas thing got ripped off. Well, yeah, you fucking destroyed it. Of course it was on fire. <laughs> Yeah, my insurance wants to tow it to the dealership to try to fix it. <laughs> That's what I said. So underneath my car- Now we're really riding on the ground. <laughs> <laughs> my, uh, my car is on the ground, guys. Everything under here is just completely ripped up. Rip skirt mobile, rip clickbait R8. Rip clickbait. my mother's trust. No, no, I trust you, I was just freaking out. Even though he said he's they're fine, I'm like literally, Taylor and Trish are like, stop, you're gonna get us in a wreck. Well, she was, <laughs> mm.
I felt absolutely no pain after the crash. I guess it was just adrenaline, but whenever I woke up this morning, my lower back hurt and my neck hurt a little bit. My grandma told me that's what would happen just because of your adrenaline. And maybe your elders are truly wise because my back hurts. But yeah, guys, uh, that is basically it for this video. That is the story and a little bit of the footage from the day. I'm gonna try my best to make sure that I can release the dash cam footage to you guys. But yeah, don't forget to leave a like and share with the friends if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you're new and I'll see you guys in the next one. I didn't die. Shout out to my man upstairs. It ain't fault, actually. Well, I don't know. Good night.